So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course I'm back with her really quick. Oh, of course Pokemon review. I feel like I just did a Pokemon review, but of course this in the next episode I am gonna review because they kind of tied in with each other. We already know what happens in this episode. You already know thumbnail. Everything's been spoiled. I'm so excited for this episode. And actually, decently good episode. I was skimming through and everything. Like holy crap! Like finally, this is a really good episode. Because actually, the episode was fan service to Trimple Car. I was like, oh yeah, let's debuff them and make them better. The big horse feel was, wasn't that bad. I got like all the little videos somewhere around me. I have a buff, so you got to see everywhere. Then the video, I have a buff somewhere. I usually do it anyway, though. But yeah, um, this episode's not a bad one. There was actually a really good story episode, and it did lead on to the next one, I believe. And it's a little thing this time around. I actually really do like that. It's actually really cool and everything. I'm really excited to review this episode because it's focused on really fun, finally finding her father. And of course, Gladion, Lucimi, and of course, all the memes from Pokemon Sun and Moon. Basically, rolled up into one here, though. So, yeah. Um, so kind of crazy, though. Like, this episode, like, is really, really good. Like, I feel like it's really good because I feel like the drought, it was kind of like a big drought, like the Lucario and Gridge episode. I feel like it was a really big drought there. Like, nothing like, really, really happened. Of course, that's going with the Ryan episode, which wasn't that bad. I think that was a little bit better. Um, <clears throat> not like talking to life, like, it was actually decently good. Um, but yeah, like, it wasn't, like, that bad and stuff like that. I think it was, like, decently good. But yeah, I'm um, reviewing over and over with episode, of course, though, so if it cuts out, blah, 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 you know how that goes. Um, yeah, you know, I got changed in the video, so if you better, you guys know how I work it. I might hear stuff all the again. Okay, I think I'm just going crazy. I'm hearing stuff all the like, last, like, couple of videos. Um, I think I might do, like, a meme issue video later, I don't know why. I don't know. But yeah, of course. Oh, uh, see, of course, you see the gang actually going to the crown of... Kind of, okay, there it is. Uh, kind of tundra area of, um, of course, you know, the inmate and everything, of course. Because it seems a little bit, um, you know, just kind of doesn't really know what's going on and everything, of course. But then, um, you know, they have stuff to head out and everything. But of course, they see Lily and, of course, um, uh, the whole, basically, like, the whole, yeah, the... Lily got in on this main family? Yeah, we see, of course, our family and stuff like that. Just, um, chilling out, relaxing. Of course, this mean getting, you know, um, flashback to her father, um, the Lily getting flashback to her father, just playing the and everything, of course, just ready to encourage to keep going and everything, of course. Um, then, of course, ready to go, then they, um, see McGear and, um, Having a little, another little like map coordinate kind of session where it's basically trying to um, pick up on the father and everything. Of course, and leads uh, them to the Clown of Tundra as well. So, of course, Ash and um, the rest of the game, the Galar gang, I'll say that, Galar gang, Galar squad, head out to um, one of the professors that are so researching on the um, area and everything. Of course, and they decide, decide to stay there and everything over the night because um, they see them. Like, they're already ready to go and everything, but the weather is so bad they can't really, really go anywhere. And the episode's kind of like here, it's really obviously because we see. Um, the whole, like, you know, Lily's family struggle while, um, Ash and everybody's just, you know, ready to, um, you know, rest up and get well. So, yeah, they're just ready to encourage on, keep going and everything, of course, on our ex, really do like that. They've really grown and shown how much they, like, really more care about each other. They would seem to be falling back, you know, sun and moon, so I actually really like that. Of course, see the gang talking, resting, they're ready to go. All the gang is, um, resting with the balls, getting the episodes flopping back and forth, which you know, a little bit, though. And they, we actually get to a really crazy good moment here. It just kind of happens out of nowhere. So of course Lily feels like she's kind of recognizes this place and everything. And you actually see her father like just fly out out of nowhere. Like it's kind of really crazy. Like her father literally comes out of nowhere. And I was like, okay, this kind of just happens literally out of nowhere. So her father like literally just kind of comes out of nowhere. So yeah, of course she's um calling up against him um you know because she hasn't seen like in years and in the games they did specify that um I, I know the game is in America completely different, but you know it specifies him like going to the warm pole. Um, but I'm kind of glad, like, we finally get to follow up to that, though, in some in, in journey specifically. Again, okay, the story focuses on pretty much everybody at this point, though. The next episode was a little thing, so this episode will carry on to the next one, which I actually like that. Of course, she's super shocked and surprised. Even Lucy just started, like, Lucy and Gladion are just, like, standing there, like, don't even know what to do. Um, and of course, um, because you already know that's a sore arc, um, runs to, um, him and everything, of course. Um, okay, that's right. Okay, that was another card. Um, but yeah, like, even he's, like, shocking everything, see how much is growing and everything. Of course, Lucy and Gladion just full out, like, don't even know what to do, because, you know, it's been so many years and everything. But definitely does make sense. I feel like that's a really good, um, good personal reaction for Lucy, because, you know, without her character, you know, she's, she's so serious, everything. Like, in the anime, she's really, like, nice and sweet, you know, researching. But in the game, she's, like, she's more serious, Sondere, like, vibes. So, of course, Gladion, like, it loses me just full on good characters in this episode, because, like, we have, like, no idea what they're going to do. Of course, they come in and everything. Um, they might like have like amnesia kind of ish because you know he's you know been walking so long he's probably lost like, a lot of his memories and everything of course. I'm um, often um, you know teen everything. 
I guess it'd be cool on Pokemon Guys you know, in general, like, you know, this type of stuff, like, it's, it's always fairly typical, though, so, yeah, again, like I said, in this episode, just follow that space, though, but yeah, of course, the same while resting and everything, of course, um, of course, those of me doesn't even know, like, what to do, like, her and Glyon have, like, no loss for words, Lily is super shocked as well, because she just hasn't even seen her father in years, but Glyon, those of me really remember, you know, um, the times and everything, of course, again, after he left, like, the whole family did change, and we all already seen that already, pretty much. But yeah, of course, you actually see, like, another, was it, what, UB something? I can't remember. Of course, they all get flashbacks to, um, you know, the, um, cri the crisis that they had in the world of it, pretty much, the Roger Warhol arc, pretty much. Um, could sit there playing, kind of, like, as Lily, of course, he, um, can't recognize it as a friend and everything, of course. They're not trying to pull them out, of course. They're all just worried about it, don't know what to do, though, so, of course, they try to search around to find more memories coming from and everything. Of course, then we see the Gallic game squad, um, basically pull up and everything, um, which is really cool, uh, we're gonna have some guys in the world, uh, of course. But yeah, again, he thinks he's literally, literally just playing the piano over and over and over again, probably just because he's remembering everything, uh, being messed up and lost and everything, of course. And of course, Louis starts to investigate, try to find some new light, um, shame on the situation and everything, of course, Glad, you know, finds something as well. Of course, Louis finds something as well, of course, we see the, um, oh yeah, Ultra Recon, um, little, um, symbol right there, which that was kind of obvious a little bit, because again, he did work on the phone call before the guy took it in. Of course, we see, um, Ash coming in blazing, um, yeah, re reuniting Glion and Lily, which I think is pretty cool as well. Uh, of course, you always get asked, like, what's going on and stuff like that, like, how they know. And of course, we see Pikachu and um, Lily back together, which I love that. I always love that. Um, there. So that was actually pretty cool. Um, of course, we see more of them try to build this puzzle together. Of course, everybody else is shocked, though, as well. Um, just, you know, figuring out, like, you know, really dad like, laughing and everything. Of course, we see that good. Of course, we see um, you know, Pokemon and everything, of course, just going to rampant and crazy. Um, everybody just playing the situation, going back to, um, what they are doing before and everything. Again, it's just, like, flopping back and forth between flashes and this and that, like, you know, again, just flopping back. But typical story. Very, very typical story stuff, just going back and forth with flopping and everything. Um, but yeah. Um, but yeah, though. Then, of course, um, see, like, Magirna, um, you know, staring, of course, I see, um, Lucy just ask questions of it and Gladiant as well. Again, they're just all, like, crazy, suspicious and everything. Of course, Goat will love this, you know, research everything perspective, of course. Uh, we see him slowly, um, you know, flashing back to everything, memory, everything, going kind of crazy and everything as well, though. So, yeah, that happens. Um, him getting dragged and everything, him just not really much remembering anything. Him just going, uh, you know, pretty much crazy and insane. So, of course, he recovers, um, the Pokemon does play a little pretty much in his head and everything. Playing on the memories of him and everything, just again, leading on, um, going on and explaining the stories, slowly putting and building up the pieces together, like, for this specifically, though. And, of course, he starts to remember pretty much everything, on uh, everything, what happened and everything. So, yeah, of course, they're all reunited, all to get together again. I'm happy and everything. I actually do like this episode. Again, the story was really done. Uh, remembering everything, pretty much, giving himself, you know, the whole family reunion, pretty much, though. And I actually do love this episode. It's actually really, really well done. And it pretty much ends off there, though, again, then just talking about the memories. Being happy. I think Glion actually catches the Pokemon. I saw the um, update file for him. He actually does end up catching his Pokemon, which is actually pretty cool. I like that though. Of course, they all remember everything. Being a family happy together, um, you know, typical moment Pokemon and everything. I like it though. This episode was actually really good though. And it does end off there pretty much. But yeah, um, that was me reviewing the episode. Overall, I really enjoyed it. It was a different tank. I'm so glad it was a more serious slash story of him building up the pieces of his past. And Lily's dad passed pretty much and couldn't get together. Going around the house, making sure to find everything, make sure to drop his memory back. It looks like he has a form of amnesia pretty much though, and you already know why the Pokemon builds up to this. And at first I was, I was like, holy crap, like they full on just said everything, like he runs a father. But he probably has like amnesia, he doesn't know what to do, like again, he's lost. Pretty much like a lost kingdom of soul, so of course they have to find pieces of out. You can see Ash and Lily re reunite again as well. Again, like, I feel like they're really good. I know, like, everyone said, that, um, you know, the little girl ships like Ash and like Mallow, Lana. I like all the ships, so the Ash and Lily one was really more like a get together one. Um, like with the whole, like, you know, egg snowy arc and everything. I think that was actually like, really good when I first came out for Sun and Moon. I think I really enjoyed that lot as well. And overall, this as well, this actually was really good. I actually like this episode. Like, again, way good story. Everything builds up from like, the last series into this one. It's beautiful, awesome, I love it. Okay. Uh, okay, car, that's why. Yeah, it's beautiful, awesome, I love it all. It was great. I cannot agree with this episode. It's probably another good top episode of my pick because you, know, you see everybody together, everybody back together. We can just load the pizzas and put it back together pretty much. It's just like utterly insane, utterly everything. It's beautiful, awesome, great. It's just like overall really, really good. And I, um, I won't bring you though. 
but overall still really good overall still a great episode i love it all the story was amazing the characters were amazing this is really back on track to pokemon again like she always says the map from the beginning you know, including out your father was really good the researchers for um you know ash Chloe, and go pretty much um then like again this episode is mainly focusing on them and like not the gala squad but they're the lily's family lose me's family basically and then like if you're falling back and forth and seeing their struggles and you know their journey how they come stronger and closer as a family together and just we ended off a beautiful good written looking episode again i feel like the same people did the action ninja episode probably helped out with this one the animation is beautiful the coloring the lighting the shading it's all beautiful it's all amazing i can gush about this all day if i could but this is really a really good episode at least top five for me I think it's a really good top five for me because again, the animation is beautiful. Everything's great. It looks all everything is looking last year except this one. It's beautiful. Everything's like a good step in the right direction. And now I love it I really much for it. See you guys later though. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Quite a lot of fun you So stay safe. Watch around. God bless all of you. Go out. Come on back. And put the guru in too. Best thing if you can. Go outside. Test some grass. Eat some cookie. And you're in Hawaii. And drink some water. You already know how it is. So I got to think about all this info though. Of course, like you hate it again. Very simple. Very really easy. I loved it all. I think it looks good. Um, I really enjoyed this episode a lot, like, easily top 5 in my episode. I feel like the next episodes could be kind of like this. We have animation, we're going back to the logo again. Double this video, probably right when I'm done with it and everything. Again, I got so many videos of, um, I recorded, and get out sooner or later. I don't know. Yeah. See you guys later though, again, though.